Bootstrap typography is to provide consistent and visually appealing typography styles for web developers to use in their projects. It offers a predefined set of typography classes and styles that can be easily applied to text elements within a website or web application. Like this display typography design provided by Bootstrap, which allows a certain word to stand out almost similar to a header tag. However display appears to be bigger than H1. Display appears to be in six different sizes. From display-1 to 6. What we only need is to include class display-1 or any sizes from 1 to 6. Upon refreshing the page, you'll find it more bigger compared to the header tag. But slightly thinner in appearance. Let's create another display class to compare the size of the header and the display class provided by Bootstrap. This is how it looks like when you use display to header, but use it according to your liking, this use for titles or as segment titles of a certain website. Now let's look for the lead, which states here that make a paragraph stand out by adding dot lead. We can include this one inside your paragraph to make it stand out from the normal size font. Let's test this one out. Let's create a paragraph, and inside it is lorem ipsum, then include the class lead. Make sure to save before you refresh your browser in order for you to see the changes. So, this how it looks like when it comes to lead compared to a normal paragraph, it does makes your paragraph stand out compared to the normal one. Next, we have here the block quotes, somewhat changes to the appearance of a certain paragraph. We just need to insert block quote tag, and inside it we class block out as a class value. Use block quote tag, then add paragraph tag inside the block quote. I will just insert lorem, then include block quote as the class. So this is the normal appearance. Then, I'll include block quote class to see the difference between the normal paragraph and with block quoted paragraph. Check the difference among this paragraph, you might want to use them accordingly, in such a way it will make your output stand out compared to the rest. Let's include the block quote footer in order to insert the name of the person who needs to be acknowledged. Then insert the name of the person. We can also change the alignments by using text center and text end inside the class of the tags you want to align them accordingly. I'm just going to copy and paste the block quote that I created for you to see the difference among the normal or default alignment which is the left, the text center and the text end. That's it for this, we applied display, block quotes, a block quotes footer, then alignments center and end.